hear you're off to the boils little bash tonight. I have just a tiny favor I'd like to ask you. Could you give this note to Lord Shaw? You'll know him. A rather brusque man wearing a wolf's mask. In fact, he may be looking for me. I knew Sokolov would see reason and tell us what we need to know. He never actually liked the Lord Regent. Have you ever been in a sea battle? Of course. The Boyle Costume Ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. You ready? yourself, Corvo. They don't fool around. The good news is, once you get to the party, that mask of yours lets you blend right in. Enjoy your evening out with the folk of quality. Better you than me. Is that what you dreamed of, all those months in Cold Ridge Prison while waiting for the Executioner? Wealth, beautiful women in the latest fashions, laughing and drinking Tibian wine. And what of the host, Lady Boyle? I can see all her tomorrows, and I know that either she dies tonight at your hand, or she'll live out her days, month after month, year after year, far away even as her fine clothes wear into tatters and her silken hair gets dull and gray. Half the city can see the lights from the party and they dream of the delights inside. Will you tear it all to pieces? Either way, it's Lady Boyle's last party.
have no choice but to play. It's going to be brilliant. It's going... Oh! They want my invitation! Maddie, don't chase after that. You don't know what's in those buildings. No place is safe anymore. I don't understand what's happened to this city. Here. I'm sure she'd like that. Why don't you wait here as any gentleman would? Right this way, sir. Look at that mask. Another Sick party bastard. game. It was fun for a season, but now... What is it tonight? Guess which is which. Their hair and makeup are identical. But one's in red, one's in black, one's in white. There's a prize at the end. Things are bad. Oil. Could the city get any worse? Never doubt it. Then again, the cameo is worth it. Doesn't Esma's bed... Here there are other ways into Esma's bedroom. Oh, don't flatter yourself. Just thinking out loud. Oh my, that's wicked. Who made that mask for you? It's exactly like the wanted posters. That's going to cast a pall over the whole evening. The party's indoors this time. Cold night, sir. Warmer indoors. Sir, you'll find everything. Welcome inside. to the Boyle estate. If you get your own squad after what happened last night, yes, of course. Yes. Pendleton? Hmm. What's he got to say to me? Pendleton is a gutless lying sack of shit. I hope he's paying you well for this. It's damn cold tonight. Hurry up, and let's see what you're made of. Lord Pendleton's representative will select his weapon. Test of honor will take place between this anonymous gentleman acting for the challenger Lord Trevor Pendleton and Lord Shaw, the challenged party. 
You will each turn and proceed to the marked positions and remain facing away from each other as I count down from three. You may then turn and Get fire on with it. I'll kill this fool and we can all go back inside. Sorry, my lord. We shall proceed. Stop! Stand right there. Face away from your opponent. Three. Two. One. And that's another patron dead. What do we do now? It's lucky we're in demand. I hear the Estermonts pay top coin. No use trying them tonight. Let's see if we can find a little brandy. Let the boils clean up the mess. Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Indeed, I believe so. Careful. We tried for a peek upstairs, and the man on duty is an ass. I should have taught him some manners. This party is a sham. I'm sure he's just doing his job. A party like this, anyone might have crept in. Excuse me, my cousin is a Marquis. Of course I don't mean you, but people are desperate. And the Boyles are awfully wealthy these days. Nonsense. Waverly just hires officers from the watch to impress people. Your obsession with the Boyles. Will it never end? Did you hear about Mrs. Grimsley? You'll never believe this. What is it now? She had her jobber pick up a boy in the street. Barely 16 years old. No family left. I thought her interests were confined to her family. I think she ran out of family. What can I get for you? What's it all about? Welcome to the Boyle Estate. Emma, you could get her sent to the Abbey. Nobody that rich gets sent anywhere they don't. Sickening rat. <laughs> Gentle. Go ahead, help yourself. I take everything I can carry. They'll never miss it. Evening, sir. You should see this as an opportunity. To what? Learn a trick. Go ahead, take it. Everyone does. I had a servant sew me an extra pocket. Indeed. I know your mission tonight. We must speak. Privately.
I'm a friend of Pendleton's, and I've done a few favors for your cause. I know your purpose here tonight, and how to say this, your target is the woman I love. I swear that if you'll bring her to me unharmed, you will never hear of her again. There's a cellar directly below the kitchen. I'll wait for you there. I'm not proud of this, but surely it's better than seeing her killed. Her name is Esma. I won't harm her, I swear. I'm a man of means. Just bring her to the cellar, and I will keep her safe with me. Forever. Welcome to my party. I don't believe you've had the pleasure. Carry mask. Doing all right? Ooh, scary mask. Don't be silly. The rumors say the Boyles practically own your estate. What if I said I could get you out of the city? Away from I trust you are on the guest list, sir. You? But if you're telling the truth, we should talk further. But not. Did you get your own squad what happened last night? Indeed. I believe so. Rats came a half a year before. Excuse me. No guests past this point. Where is she? Hurry and bring her to me. Excuse me. Oh, leave him be. It's a party. Oh, hello, handsome. I'm already seeing two of you, but thanks anyway. Silly, she's wearing red tonight. <laughs> oh my word, I wasn't supposed to say, was I? Lydia and Waverly will be so furious. This is exactly what they said would happen. That sounds lovely. 
Why don't you come with me? We found out what the whales could do when it made us an empire. This is the beginning of a golden age. Do you know they've dug down and found the ruins of another city under this one? Excuse me. Dirty little secret. You can't imagine who I'm seeing. I mean, if people only knew. But I'm only doing it to ensure the family name. It's too dangerous right now not to have proper connections. <clears throat> Truthfully, if I could get free of him, I would. You're more my type. Mysterious, silent, self-composed. I do believe this is going to be a fabulous evening. Get her on board. Last. Oh, my love. Someday you will understand. You'll never know how happy you've made me. Someday she'll learn to appreciate me. After all, she'll have her whole life.
They told me not to let anyone up here. Do me a favor and head back down. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed your evening, sir. But we'd best be on our way. Quickly. Said he would meet us here. I checked the wine cellar. Losing family gives a man a thirst. 